ultrasound can be used to create beautiful pictures of what's hidden, which is how we see babies before they are born. But did you know that ultrasound can be used in very different ways? Recent scientific research has proven that ultrasound can be used as a therapeutic tool to treat cancerous cells or to deliver drugs in the brain at precise locations. Ongoing research looks at treatment of Alzheimer's or Parkinson's disease or, in the future, ultrasound can be used to treat severe psychiatric disorders like depression or anxiety. Here's how it works. Ultrasound are sound waves with such high frequencies that we can't hear them, although some animals can. But these ultrasound waves can produce a range of effects depending on how we use them. For example, broad ultrasound waves are used for imaging, doing nothing to the region it's targeting, just taking pictures. On the other hand, focusing the beam of ultrasound to a certain area of the body increases the energy in this area. A bit like a magnifying glass focuses broad beams of sunlight to a specific point to increase the energy in this area. The more energy, the more ultrasound can transform its target. For example, with very, very high intensity, ultrasound can heat and ablate tumors, like how we could be burned by the sun with a magnifying glass. But at much lower intensities, ultrasound can just temporarily change how certain parts of the brain behaves in a safe way. This could potentially help people suffering from psychiatric issues, particularly because the technique is so precise that it would allow us to reach even deeper areas in the brain. This is important because different regions are involved in different psychiatric disorders. For more news on research discovery, follow our research at BRIC, the Brain Research Imaging Center at the University of Plymouth, supported by the UKRI and the MRC.